Hi. Hi, Hi Jackson. Hi. <laughs> Today, Florentine and Pig are going on a very long walk in the countryside. So, so we're going to make them some pesto pasta, which is Pig's favourite. He loves it. So what we do first is make sure we've washed our hands. Have we? Yes. Let's have a look. Let me have a look. Yes, they look very clean and sparkly. Very Jackson. sparkly. It's very good. <laughs> okay, so first of all, you get some of this lovely basil. Four tablespoons of basil, just roughly. Don't need to measure it exactly. So I'd say that, like that. Lots of basil. Rip it up and pop it into the whizzer. Righty ho. What's next? We're going to add some pine nuts. We're going to have four tablespoons of pine nuts. Then we've got 75 grams of Parmesan cheese. Do you like Parmesan if you on your pasta? Mmm. So we're just going to break that up into cubes and pop it in the jojo. So our final ingredient for the pesto, Jackson, is... Olive oil. Olive oil, exactly. And we have eight tablespoons of that going into the whizzer. We simply put the lid on. Are you ready for this? We're going to have to do the whiz whiz dance. Here we go. And go. Whiz 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 We're going to add some cooked peas. Do you like peas? Yep. Oh, brilliant. Add the peas in. We're going to have to do some stirring in a minute, Jackson. Stir it up. And I'm going to add a blob of our homemade pesto. Pig's favourite. Ready? So you're going to keep on mixing. Here we go. Blob it in. <gasps> Yum. And now that needs to cover all of that pasta so it'll mix all around and make it all lovely and green and shiny and glossy. All of those peas mixed in and all of that lovely Please, pesto. Don't to do this. Well that's lucky we've got you then. Wow, Florentine and Pig are going to be able to walk for miles after eating this, aren't they? Oh yeah. Do you think we've got enough pesto? We need a bit more in there. We need a bit more. A little bit more. There we go, mix it all up then. That'll be enough now. And that will be enough. Hand, and then we're going to use these holes here and we keep our fingers away from the edge that's right that's right yep and down slowly up and down do you want to hold it with this hand look very good well done you so we've got our lovely that's pigs pesto and pasta muddle because it's all muddled up look everything's all in the muddle so why don't you sprinkle that bit on and then Yummy. We need a bit more. Use the stuff that we've got on the board, look. Put all the rest on. That's it. Then that'll be enough. That'll be enough. And then enough. there's one more thing you need to do. What? You need to pick a couple of those leaves off. That's it. And sprinkle them on top. Yummy in my tummy. Who would like to have a taste? Me. <gasps> yeah. Me. It looks delicious. Go on then. You two have a little go. See what you think. Mmm. Mmm. So, you know what we've got to do? One, two, three! Florentine and pig! pig! Let's keep eating anyway. Because you were my water. Hello, hello! Hello! I'm Laura. I'm Jess. And I'm Jackson. And if you or any of your friends want to make any of these recipes we've made at home, you can look on the shopping list and go into the shop and buy them, or you can click on the link below and go straight to www.acardo.com. Bye! Bye! Bye.
feel so right, it's wrong And I love until the end So why don't you settle 